A big crowd is expected at tonight's meeting in the Riverland on the imminent closure of the Cadell ferry service across the River Murray. Locals are worried the Transport Department's decision will lead to the town's demise. James Hancock reports. Only about 400 people live here at Cadell, about two hours drive northeast of Adelaide, but the issue has sparked anger right across the Riverland. The Transport Department wants to shut down the 24-hour service at the end of the month. Locals fear their town won't survive because motorists will bypass the area, forcing businesses to close. There's also concern about the future of the local primary school. The principal says the move could result in funding cuts because five students from across the river are likely to change schools. And fruit growers with properties on both sides of the Murray say they'll be hit with thousands of dollars a year in extra transport costs associated with using other ferries. Well, I think it's madness for a relatively uh, low cost when you've got the whole sheep, the whole countryside involved. No, it's ridiculous. Yeah, I've crossed it twice today, going across to work and back. So I guess if this is not here, I have to go via Wakery, which is longer. It's been hard enough with the drought with the business, so if the business goes down anymore, who knows, you know? You could have to close doors, you know? On the other hand, the Transport Department argues that only 100 motorists use the ferry every day. It says the service costs $400,000 a year to operate, and that money could be reinvested in the 11 other ferries along the river. Protest signs have been set up around the town, with the meeting due to start shortly at the town's institute building.